Minister Davutoglu and I uh, have had a very fruitful meeting and as always in a very friendly and constructive uh, atmosphere. Turkey has been a member, uh, a vital member of NATO for 60 years and uh, many things have changed um, in that time, but our commitment to each other has not. Uh, Turkey plays an important role in our operations and we are particularly grateful for your steadfast uh, commitment to our uh, ISAF uh, operation. Uh, Turkey has an important voice in our decisions and Turkey has a vital part to play in shaping our partnerships. Together, we are the most successful military alliance in the world. Our commitment to collective defense is the world's uh, best insurance policy and together we are stronger than any one of us would be alone. In three months' time, we will hold our NATO summit uh, in Chicago. We will have to deliver real responses to the real challenges uh, that we face, and Turkey's contribution will be vital. We'll have to set out how we will help the Afghan forces take responsibility for security in their own uh, country, and how we will support them once they have done so. We will have to enhance our partnerships around the world, and we will have to find a smarter way of doing business in these tough economic times, spending better when our spending is restricted. We will also have to take forward our work on missile defense. Um, this is a modern response to a modern threat. It embodies our enduring principle of solidarity, and Turkey plays a vital role in it. Turkey does more than just share our security. You shape it. Uh, your experience, your expertise uh, in the Middle East and North Africa are invaluable. They benefit the whole of NATO. And that is particularly important now. Across the region, the people are rising up and demanding their rights, the same rights um, that we, as NATO citizens, have long enjoyed. As the Arab Spring unfolds, continued Turkish leadership will be crucial. Because Turkey is a vital part of this region, and Turkey is a vital part of NATO.